His name is Alec Burleson, and he's for the St. Louis Cardinals. He's 24 years old. He's six foot two, 212 pounds. He's already a man, and everybody else can just run away. He was drafted in 2020, St. Louis Cardinals, in uh, pick number 70 overall out of East Carolina. And I, I want to say this with the best gumption that I can possibly say it with. If it wasn't for Paul Goldsmith being like the greatest first baseman in our era, Alec Burleson would be in the major leagues right now. But ipso facto, Goldsmith is amazing. And Alec Burleson going to have to play in the outfield because – Goldschmidt's not going anywhere anytime soon. Just to touch on a few things, I don't even want to go into everything before 2022 because in 2022, it was amazing. He had 432 at-bats, 20 home runs. He walked 29 times. He only struck out 67 times. His average was 331. His on-base was 372. He slugged 532 and his uh, on-base plus slugging was 904. There's nothing that I dislike about Alec Burleson's profile. I think he is going to be a tremendous Cardinal. I think he's going to start this year and nobody's going to get in his way. Maybe later down in in the future, he'll, he'll be at first base, but 2023, he will be in the outfield, and he is going to rock all the Cardinals fans. What do you think, Ross? I like it. Scott, the sat line system doesn't love him. He didn't make it into our top list. But oddly enough, it was from Scott, the stat line, that I first came across him. And when he debuted in 2021, that that first sample said he was slugging 595 in high A before he went up to double A and he continued mashing. It wasn't until in his debut season, mind you, he was bumped up to triple A that he really started struggling. It has brought his numbers down a little bit. But this year, repeating the level, yeah, he just smashed it. He went through the numbers, 905 OPS, hits home runs. I I could see it. He's got a he's blocked, you know. <laughs> He's, yeah. he's locked in that system. It's going to be really hard for him to find playing time. If he does, if there's injury or he just hits his way into it, I, I could see him holding down a spot for sure. Yeah. One of my biggest, biggest prospect favorites right there, man. You guys, if, if he's just floating out there or if somebody just doesn't quite want to hold on to him, go get him now. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and of course visit our website, scoutthestatline.com, for more.